Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Just decided I will give you guys something new. You've seen the title. This is reacting to entire Blu-ray collections from other Bluetubers, YouTubers. Um, hopefully you guys will enjoy this one, something different. I don't know if anybody else is doing it. Um, just something I decided to do to give you guys some other content other than just trailer reactions. So hopefully you guys will enjoy it. If you do enjoy it, make sure you comment in the comment section. Leave a comment in the comment section whether or not you want me to continue this as a pre-recorded video or would you guys rather me go live, do it, and we all react to it together. But nonetheless, man, let's get into this video. I'm trying to keep it with people with shorter videos. Some of these videos I'm finding are over two hours long. There's no way I'm about to react to a two-hour video. Quite sure y'all don't want me to sit through a two hour video and try to react to it because you ain't gonna watch it either but nonetheless man up first we got mark critics um is his name we're gonna re review his collection we're gonna grade it at the end let's get into it it's been a year since he's uploaded anything dealing with physical media now he's into vinyl Panel. but here Whatever it is let's get into it uh, album a music album so if you guys could just maybe check out the channel it'd be highly appreciated so let's get into the video Eight miles, nine, 12 years a slave, great movie, 21 Jump Street, 22 Jump Street, 28 Days Later, great zombie film, 42, Very good. 50 50, really great comedy about kind of a topic that's like, I haven't seen that one, first, but hard to talk about in like film, 127 hours. 500 days of summer 2001 a space odyssey oh yeah oh yeah ad astra loved it aladdin classic alien still need to watch oh my gosh i know y'all tired of aliens in the collection battles but and phenomenal aliens. movie an alien cover. okay and then, so let me say this before we continue uh, at least he's got it alphabetized, um, starting off with the numbers. I believe that's how everybody does it. So good job to him for that. And y'all let me know, do y'all like the way he's showing his movies? Do you like when people just pull it out from the uh, off the shelf? Or do you rather be sitting like I am and show you the movie and then pass it along, go to the next one? Let me know in the comment section. Let's continue. Camera angle. American Beauty. Okay. American Psycho. I still need to get that 4K. American Sniper. A very good, intense World movie. London, Ant Man, Ant Man and the Wasp, Apocalypse Now. Gotta have it, classic. Arrival. Good sci-fi. The Artist. Haven't seen it. At Eternity's Gate. I, I really love this movie. I watched it like a month ago. Avatar. Avengers. Avengers: Age of Ultron. Infinity War. And Endgame. Babadook. Couple titles I expect a young younger person Baby to have. Driver. Back to the Future trilogy. Uh, Bad Times at the El Royale. Barry Lyndon. Batman in particular. Batman nice. Begins. The Dark Knight. Dark Knight Rises. Batman Ninja. I need to watch this, but it looks so. So I'm gonna say this. Those Batmans. Uh, it's been a year, like I said, but hopefully he's upgraded to the 4Ks on the ones that he does not own 4Ks just yet. Like, silly. I don't know. It's fun. Batman the Killing Joke. I don't know why I bought this, honestly. <laughs> Battle of the Sexes. Beauty and the Beast and BFG. I don't know why I have these, even though BFG is kind of fun, I guess. Big. Classic. Big Hero 6. Big Lebowski. Big Classic. Fan. I love the Still need to own that one on 4K. Third favorite movie. Still haven't seen that. Fun Black fact. Landsman. Really like this movie. I want to check out more Spike Lee stuff. Black Swan. Blade Runner. And Blade Runner 2049. Blair Witch Project. Might be my favorite horror film. Classic. Movie. Actually watched it in high school in Earth Science Black class. Swan, one of the most underrated films of all time. I think I absolutely love this movie. Book Smart. Eh, nah. Boy in the World. Boyhood, Brave, I don't know why I have that, Breakfast Club, great 80s film, Bridge of Spies, I watched this in class and I actually really liked it, that was written by the Coen brothers I believe, watched that in class, wow, Bugs Life, Bumblebee, I'm just gonna read these, Burn After Reading, Cabin in the Woods, Captain America, the First Avenger, 
Okay. Like how he's speeding it up a little bit for the sake of time. Okay. Love that. Civil War 4K Steelbook. Casablanca. Castaway. Christopher Robin. Chronicle. Love Chronicle. Very good. Wow. City Lights. Clerks. Clockwork Orange. Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. Cloverfield. Coco. All right, let's pause it right there, you guys, because I'm not going to put you through the whole 15 minutes. You guys can go back and watch the whole thing if you want. We're going to skip ahead a little bit, but I'm going to say this right now. I don't know how old he is, but to see what he has in his collection, I'm pretty impressed because he seems pretty young and he's got some range. He's got a lot of different genres from a lot of different time periods so far. So I'm, I'm digging this and I'm liking the way he's filmed this. So good job to Mark Critiques. But let's skip along just a little bit. Hunger Games, I don't know why I have that either. Hurt Locker. Hustlers. I mean, a hustler, not hustlers. Gotta Mike get Tyler. it right. If Beale Street could talk. Incredibles. The Indiana Jones collection. 4K coming Inside soon. Can't wait. my favorite Tarantino. We need more Inside Tarantino on 4K. Definitely. Insomnia. Interstellar. Oh, my favorite movie. Yeah, Giant. I need to do a top 10 Iron for you Man guys. One, two, and three. Isle of Dogs, Great Wes Anderson. It. It Comes at Night. James Bond Collection. Jaws. John Wick 1, 2, and 3. Jojo Rabbit, great comedy from last year. Joker. Jumanji, uh, Welcome to the Jungle, Jungle Book, and Juno. Once again, loving how he's now, just skipping ahead. Show, Sake of time. You don't want these videos to go too watch. long. Kick ass. Kiki Delivery Service. It's out, so it's more loose. Knives Out. Knives Out. Fix that later, no worries. Kong Skull Island. Kubo and the Two Strings. How to Train Your... I mean, uh, Kung Fu Panda 1 and 2. La La Land, my favorite film. Lady Bird. Lego Movie 1. One of the best animated films of the decade. And Lego Movie 2, disappointing. Not that great, but it's entertaining. Definitely right about that, but I don't know about that Lego one comment he just made. Miss. Letters from Iwo Jima. The Lighthouse, one of my favorite films. Easily my favorite. Still my favorite haven't seen it. I gotta see it. It's okay. gotta come in my collection. The Lion King 4K. Little Miss Sunshine. Oh, God. Logan. Lone Survivor. Two great Lone ones. Shot. Looper. Good film. Lord of the Rings. One of the best franchises ever. One of the best 4Ks ever. It needs to upgrade that. Martian. Marion Max, a really underrated film. One of my favorites. The Matrix. Maze Runner. The Meg. This was like a joke gift someone gave me. Mid-90s. Great directorial debut from Jonah Hill. Midsummer. Mm. Missing Link. Fun. Mission Impossible Collection and then Fallout. Moana. Modern Times Criterion. Moneyball. Monsters, Inc. All right, you guys, I'm, I'm digging this collection. This kid, he has a pretty good collection, man. And he's given us a little bit of tidbits on what he thinks about each movie. So he's not just continually going along saying this movie, then this one. He's given us a little bit of you know, information about the movie, what he likes, what he thinks about it. And he's just moving right along. So um, I know he's posted a lot of other videos. So he's doing a very good job with this video, how he's trying to, you know, manipulate the time and make sure it goes by as quickly as possible because it can go very long if you talk too much about each film. So he's doing a very good job. But for the sake of time, we're going to fast forward a little bit. Like I said, you guys can go back and watch the whole video. I've already seen his whole collection. But let's fast forward some. Rocky, I'm just going to read it. Room, Sandlot. I have a bunch of nostalgia for the Sandlot. Sausage Party, wow. Saving Private Ryan. Scott Pilgrim vs. The World. Got the slipcover. And this is one of my favorite films also. It happens. Scream. You know, we always want those slipcovers, but can't have all of them. Seven. Great David Fincher. Seven Psychopaths. 
The Shape of Water, Shaun the Sheep movie, Shazam, fun movie, Sherlock Holmes, The Shining, amazing, one of my favorite films of all time, Sicario, uh, The South of the Lambs. Was that a 4K Sicario? Silver I have to look at Simpsons movie, I have nostalgia for this. So, Sixth Sense. People love that movie. I'm not a big fan of Sixth Sense. Social it was okay. Network. Social Network was Star really good. Value. The Sam Raimi trilogy. The Mark Webb two movies. Sorry about that shake. Uh, Spider Man Homecoming and Spider Man uh, Into the Spider Verse. And then Far From Home. Into the Spider Verse is probably my favorite Spider Man film. I love this movie. Spirited Away. Swanto Squarepants, huge, huge nostalgia for this, and then I got this. So you guys see how he's giving those nice little tidbits Star as he go along? I, I love it, Star man. I love the way he's the putting this together. Great. I did. Under the Silver Lake, for an underrated film. Up, Us, The Usual Suspects, B for Vendetta. Gotta find Ice. something to hold those up, Wally. a little, some type of like Warrior. box set or something, a Watch toy them. to hold those movies up. I hate when that happens. Where the Wild Things Are. Whiplash and Wolf of Wall Street, some of my favorite movies of all time. Wonder, Wonder Woman, I Want You to Be My Neighbor, great documentary. Wreck It Ralph, Yesterday, really kind of a bad movie, but it's entertaining and I love the Beatles, so. Your Name, and then Zombie Land, Steel, 4K Steel, and Zootopia. That's probably gonna topple over. Yep, alright. So that was my entire Blu ray collection. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, hopefully, I'll be posting more. Um, soon and I just want to again bring up the music podcast that me and my friends are doing so go check that out in the description below so thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you in the next video all right what's up guys all right there you have it you guys um you guys let me know what you think of that guy's uh movie collection I thought it was pretty good um like I said I, I I'm gonna take off a few points not much there's some movies in there I know it's been a year so maybe he's upgraded, but there's some movies in there that I feel like he should have upgraded to 4K by now. I know it's a preference thing, but, you know, I'm going to take a few points off because if you're going to own Batman, those uh, the Christopher Nolan trilogy, 4K is the way to own it. Those IMAX scenes, spectacular. Um, very wide range of movies for a younger kid. Um, I know he's into vinyl and stuff like that, so he has that nostalgia to him. He loves old school stuff from what I'm seeing, so um, I love that about him. Maybe that's somebody that would be good for the movie collection battles. I don't know. Maybe look into it later down the line or something like that. Maybe he'll see my video or something. I don't know. But anyway, back to his collection, man. Like I said, I love the way he just, you know, gave us a little bit of tidbits, how he felt about the movie. You know, who was the producer? Who was the director? Who is it starring? Whether he likes it, where he would place it in his top five, top 10, anything like that. So kudos to him for making sure, you know, he entertains us with those type of things while he's showing his movies Um, because it's, you know, these videos can get very lengthy. So I like how he would get to the end of the stack and just hurry up and say, bam, 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 bam. That's what's in there. He didn't even pull them out and show them to you for the sake of time. So love how he do that. Cause like I said, some of these move, some of these uh entire Blu-ray collections that I'm seeing over two hours long. That's crazy. I'm not watching that. So great job to mark critiques. And like I said, at the end, only thing I didn't like because he couldn't show us, he couldn't pull those movies out to show us what they were when he got to like X, Y, and Z because he needed to put something at the end, some type, some type of uh, book holder or something, maybe a box like a um, Funko box if he has Funkos or something to hold those up so that we could he could pull them out and still show us the movies because he started kind of fumbling around with them and then they fail. So a little bit of presentation there that could be picked up a little bit. But overall, I would give this guy A minus. Love the collection. Wasn't very big. It was just enough. So you guys in the comment section, let me know what you would grade this if you went to the end of this video, even if you fast forward it, just let me know. Um, also, you guys, let me know how you like this video. Do you want me to continue to do reactions like this? You know, it helps get other um, creators out there so you can see who else is out there because I'm searching for them and I'm finding them. And, you know, I'm looking for the people that don't have many subscribers, don't have a ton of views and whose um, video time is short. This one's 15 minutes very good time because i don't want to react to a video that's about 45 minutes because then my video is going to be long but again you guys let me know do you like this pre-recorded do you want me to go live with it so we can all react at the same time but i think it was a cool pretty cool video enjoy doing it let me know in the comment section what you think but it's been another video with your boy 4k d ray man follow me on instagram every thursday night i am live doing movie collection battles or live q a's 
you want to be a part of the battle, hit me up on Instagram at 4KD Rate. Thanks, you guys. It's been another video, man. We are gone.